back for our second segment on the nation, joined by Palma head coach Jeff Carnals and Carmel head coach Golden Anderson. I'm John Devine. All right, Jeff, is there a better athlete on the field right now than Carmel's Devin Pearson? Nearly 8,000 passing yards in three years and 1,400 rushing yards this year, and I think a combined 41 touchdowns either throwing or running the ball this year. No, I don't think so. I think uh, he's one of the best that's ever come out of this area, no doubt about it. You know, he's exceptional. Yeah, and obviously – Devin's a special that we know that, but what has impressed me more than anything about him this year, Golden, is his leadership. I've seen this guy kind of take charge on the field this year, vocally kind of put this team on his shoulders. Yeah, everybody just sees Devin running or throwing and, and, and make a big deal out of it, but the, the, the competitor that he is, the leader that he is, that, that's what our program's going to miss the most. And, and yards are yards and wins are wins, but as far as our program and someone to emulate the type of student athlete they are, he's the guy that, that's kind of the standard for us. Sure. Jeff, how do you stop this juggernaut of an offense that's averaging 55.2 points a game? He has five good receivers. He's got a 1,500-yard running back and Holden Smith with 28 rushing touchdowns. And the offensive line, it's similar to you. It has some good size. Yeah, I, I think uh, you know no one has at this point. But, uh, you know, I, I think you got to start with, with stopping the run. You know, and that's like anything. We go into any game we play, whether it's a spread team or a double tight team, and we're going to try to stop the run and make him one dimensional and and, pa- and pass. And he's a good passer too. So sure. that's not the only thing you have to do, but you have to start there. That's a starting point. You know, he said until this point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's <laughs> one of the games that have been played. Twelve yeah. games in. Yeah. On the flip side, you know, Palmer's got two pretty talented backs as well, and Jack Myers and Marcus Washington. Good size on the offensive line. They take time off the clock, Golden. They go in these five, six-minute drives. Your offense will be limited if his offense does that. Yeah, and it's like Coach said, and we, we agree with the same philosophy. If we're going to be allowed to run the ball and we can and control the line of scrimmage, that's what we're going to do. And um, our priority on defense to control the line of scrimmage and the teams that we've been able to do that for, we've been successful. And the last couple of weeks, we made teams one dimensional. It was throw only, and that makes it be- become pretty easy to defend. Sure. Speaking of defense, Jeff, your defense has allowed just 128 points a game this year. And Jack Powers, he's a beast out there as a defensive end. Devin Morales with nine interceptions. I felt before the year started, and we talked about this back in August, I thought this was the best defense you'd had since 02 or 03. 12 games into the season, does it rank up there? I think it does. I would have to say it's probably the most physical defense I've had. Um, we've had some good defenses in the past, but uh, yeah, they're 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 they rank up there. But the physicality that they play with is 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 what I'm most impressed with, week in and week out. Sure. And Golden, before we get out of here, we don't talk a lot about your defense, and maybe that's a good thing. But in the third quarter, you guys have allowed just 34 points all season, and that's kind of when your offense kind of starts to put the game out of reach. Yeah, I don't know what quarter we've given up what or anything like that. Uh, we're trying to do our best to get off the field and limit possessions for the other team and, and maximize scoring opportunities when we're on offense. And our defense done a great job. And to be in the title game, you have to play a very good defense. I don't really think it matters how many points a game you can score. If you can play defense, you're going to be here and have a chance. 7 o'clock, NPC. 